And the server just restarted. I might be the first one to loot up this island, yo. Falafel be praised. Falafel be praised. Gatsby says, yep, totally RP. I remember all those times I was in a life or death situation. I was like, next gen, motherfucker. Yeah, you can't hate on him. He was just mad that, uh... He was just mad that the game had low FPS and he couldn't hit me. I think what initially made him mad is I wasn't willing to stand still and just let him shoot me because I knew that that's what he wanted me to do. But I'm not hating him on him for that. Again, this is like a RP recommended. You don't have to RP. RP recommended. Optional role play. I should have been like, it's not my first rodeo, buddy. I'm not going to stand still while you have a Mosin. <laughs> All right, man, let's check out this, uh, I've actually never been to this castle island. Twelve says you look like the alternate version of the new Radicals lead singer. I was actually thinking of that video when I looked at my character just now. No lie. No lie. See if I can vault this. Nah, so you can shoot through there, but you can't move through there. So it looks a lot like Devil's Castle. Um, it doesn't really have the big tall tower like Devil's Castle has, but it looks pretty cool. I have no idea where the loot spawns in here might be. It's got a cool radio tower up here too. That's pretty groovy. If Bohemia does get around to putting in some good base building and stuff, there are some really nice uh, locations to build some bases in in DayZ. Like this would be a hell of a spot. Uh, there's like a <laughs> there's like a little concession stand up here. <laughs> little concession stand up at the castle. In case you need a snack real quick.
Got some seeds. There we go. Yo, look. There's like, uh, I guess this was like a tourist thing or something. I don't know. There's like concession stands. And then there's like a ghillie net over here. All right, where's the like three M4 stacked up back here, right? Right? Multiple M4s in here, right? Nah. Now we got some reading materials in case I need to take a crap. Gas lamp, right on. There's even a house up here. Alright, so this definitely has more uh, stuff to it than Devil's Castle. That's like 100% sure. Alright, too fat to fit through there. Gotta go around. Got a field shovel, a book, and a beer. You gotta sip that beer real quick. A uh, yup says, gotta have a caretaker for the ruins. That's why I'll tell people I am. I'll be like, I'm the groundskeeper, excuse me. <laughs> I'm the groundskeeper here at the castle ruins. Yo, is there another island that away too with more ruins? Holy fuck. Look, this is like the, uh, the, the tourist trap right here. So, Badem says, talking about shooters in Bohemia, how would you feel about... Running missions on Arma 2 or 3 with viewers. Well, you know I'm always down to play with viewers as much as possible. Um, I think instead of missions, I'd prefer doing stuff like King of the Hill or Wasteland or even like Battle Royale or Arma mods and things like that. And I'd probably only be fucking around with Arma 3. But I'm definitely down. I would love to play some Arma 3 with viewers. Hell yeah. Overpock on Arma 3 is a lot of fun. Um, all right, I'm going to devour some of this food real quick. I don't think you can crouch and drink still. I think that's still a problem. Maxi says, let's, let's battle royale. Yo, man, we will. Probably not tonight, but I'm all about that armor, yeah. I play a pretty big variety of games though, so like, I'm always playing different shit basically. I have lots of different playthroughs going at the same time. It's weird, I like love video games, I don't know. <laughs> Salty says, seriously get better camo? Yo, I, I would if I could. Maybe I'll find some clothes in here. The metal wire you can use to make, uh, ooh, hello, SKS, no ammo, but whatever. Wait, hang on. No, that's 22. Couldn't be so lucky. A gun and ammo for it in the same room? Blasphemy. Uh, that ice axe is pretty good, but I have to carry it in my hands, which is a big pain in the balls. But this metal wire you can use to make like a fishing pole and all kinds of shit. Uh, I'm not going to take it right now though because it's not like essential. I'm not going to be fishing right now. I need an axe to be able to cut down a tree to make a fishing pole.
I'm gonna double check in here to make sure there's no other ammo chilling. Go fishing says Gatsby you got the hat. Yo, I will if I find a uh, axe to get the wood I need for sure. Let's head up there. Can you actually get up on that other side? I wonder. Because that'd be a great sniper spot up there if you can actually get up there. And Devin said, seriously, there's something on the floor by the table that looked like ammo. Yo, I'll look. I bet you guys are thinking of the map in here. Are you talking about this? That's a map. That's a crossbow hollow site. Shoes. Um, no ammo. I wish though. I wish. I wonder uh, if anybody's swimming out here right now. Oh, uh, look, a plaque. And you can walk around up here, actually. You just got to be really careful. But you could be sniping some motherfuckers like crazy from up here. What a great view, dude. You can see the coast, man. If you had a weapon, you'd be annihilating people. Fuck, a long-range scope? It'd be over with. And I'm going to head down and investigate the rest of the island, but... That's the coolest spot right there with the little plaque. I'm feeling it. Oh. Ooh, almost broke my legs. Careful, buddy. Don't go breaking your leggies. Now, let me look at the back porch real quick. Sometimes you get lucky. Now nah, I don't see anything spawn back there. Maxi says you'd have to do some next level sniping to hit a moving target from there. That's definitely true. But you could scare the shit out of people. And you could defend it so well because everyone who would want to come try to get you would have to swim. And while they're swimming, you got them. They're fucked. As long as you're watching, they don't slip up on you, you'd get them. Alright, I believe there's a little baby hut around over here. Maxi says, sniping is super satisfying. I agree. But, uh... I, I love using the pump action shotgun in Daisy. That's my favorite shit. I love that pump action shoddy. It's my only friend. Maxi says SKS all day. It's pretty good if you get a magazine for it. Mm. 
Definitely not gonna argue with that. I can't tell if those are real reloads in that house, but they sure do sound like them. Those are fake reloads I'm hearing, but I could have sworn I heard some real ones. Alright, that door is shut. Good thing. Could mean a thing. Ah, oh, we're totally good. Woo. <laughs> I bet someone logged out in here is what it was, and that's why the door was shut. How are we doing on this hat, though? Alright, I'm taking <laughs> slightly better camo. Not much better, but a little better. <laughs> Twelve says, I hate it when people say Z instead of Z. Yo, I do it all the time. Prepare to hate it. I usually call zombies in games like this Zeds because it's hard to tell Z from a lot of other things. And zombie is two syllables. But Zed doesn't really sound like anything else. So if you're like two Zeds, then uh, it's hard to misinterpret that. I'll start calling zombies Zordons. How about that? Zordons. I'll be like Zordon 12. Troop says, why does so many letters rhyme? It's because English is a Germanic language, and Germanic languages are um, created from the drunken slurs of uh, barbarians. That's why. Guru says I'll refer to them as insurgents. There you go. Perfect. We'll call them communists. How about that? Zambonis. There you go. <laughs> I'll use what Alchemist said. I'll call them Zambonis. Perfect. Yeah, there's like a sunken ship out there. Oh man. What do we got what do we got on there?
sweet. More red gear. I need all the red items I can find. They gotta be real though, uh, this island is probably like my favorite looking new addition to Trenaris, man. It looks pretty incredible. It seems like a really fun location to fight on. What we got here? Green bandana cap. Um, make rags out of that. My shit's pristine, so. Alright. May not be a wise move, I might get sniped, but I doubt it. Unless they're like out on their fucking power boat or something. I'm gonna drink some water. Yeah. By the way, I mentioned it a little before, but uh, I'll mention it again. I've decided to start doing the Osho on like a schedule. Because I got some feedback from people that uh, it'd be easier to catch the show if I had a schedule. And I could feel that. Uh, so the Osho is now daily for the most part. Uh, from 9 p.m. Pacific until 3 a.m. or so. So that's midnight on the East Coast. Yo, I gotta agree with what Zombie's saying in the chat. Vortex on Android is a badass app for watching Twitch. I love it. Alright, I'm stuffed. I hope I don't vomit. I'm trying to get hydrated. I would have vomit. Don't vomit, bro. Nine PM says ninth gate. Yep. Nine to three. Nine P to three A Pacific. Or midnight to uh, 6 a.m. Eastern Time. So that way y'all know when to try to shoot to uh, watch it. Ah, uh, pristine gray wellies. I was hoping for the olive hat, but it's not pristine. So it's not for me. We got a bright pink raincoat in there. No, thank you. I'll take the black boonie pristine, though. Hell yeah. And rope. Rope plus a burlap sack. And we're in business, dude. At least my guy hasn't Ralphed yet. That's a blessing. That's a blessing. Yo, y'all got a burlap sack or something? <gasps> yeah. 
That gotta be real. That's like the worst briefcase in, or backpack in the game. But uh, it's green, at least. At least I got a green one. What we got on the shovel? Worn damage. All right, so that shovel actually will do me better. <laughs> I should set up some crops out here, dude. Real talk. Real talk. I should set up some crops out here. Wouldn't that be hilarious? I'm thinking about doing it, man. I think I found some seeds on the island earlier. What are y'all thinking? Who thinks we should set up some crops out here? Yo, matches and get a little fire going now. Especially if I grab that hatchet right there. Hatchet's what, three tall? Oh yeah. Maxi says too much work, crops. Yeah, I've done them before. They take a little bit, but they're kind of fun. The effort to reward ratio is definitely not there. But it's um role playing. <laughs> It would be really funny for someone to come out here and I've got all these uh, extensive ass crops, you know? I'm like, welcome to my farm. Turn into Childrick for a minute. I never find a sledgehammer that's not like fucked up. I've never found a pristine sledgehammer. They have to be a myth. Alright, I think I've looted up the whole island. How's it going, bud? Yeah. Fucking hacker. I hurt my feet. How did you hack over to the island, Guru? With a splint, heal my feet. Yeah, I think so. I can make one for you. I got you, baby. Can you, like, put it on for me? Yeah. I have. You have a splint on you? One. Yeah, I, I made it. Well, put it on you. You, uh, you can uh, self-apply, I think. Have you been out here before? No. Me either. It's not really doing anything for me. What's wrong with your feet? Are your legs? My feet hurt. hurt. I think my, my legs are just fine. You're getting the uh, feet hurt feet. message? What condition are your shoes? Ruined. Yeah, you need I shoes. Found. You need not ruined <laughs> shoes, that's all. Hurt my Anything better than ruin. Yeah, this is Guru from uh, chat, by the way, if you can't recognize his voice. As soon as I mentioned DayZ, I saw him log off on Reign of Kings. Looking pretty good. No, don't do that.
Don't do it. Ah. Yo. It's my granddad's knife. Bastard. No, this is a different one. Okay, okay. This is a, uh, the M9 bayonet water. Oh, nice, dude. Anyway. My grandfather's was a uh, karambit. Doppler. There's nothing. There's nothing in there. Oh. -ho. All right. Um. Let's uh. Let's swim. You down to swim? Yeah. Rude. Rude. Is that more room than what I got? I'm sure. Uh, crushing my dreams every time. But I do got stick, but you can get stick. Yeah, that improvised backpack's my favorite. How much room do you have in your backpack right now? Like 12? 16? 12? Twelve. I think the improvised backpack is twenty-eight. Bala. I got twenty-five. At least I think it's. You look kind of like Santa Claus. Like a fucked up Daisy Santa Claus. Yeah, but there's no real setup shop in Daisy. There's like not base building or anything yet. Twelve says Guru was Dave's twin brother that he strangled in the womb and his spirit wandered into the nearest Dell computer. How did you fucking know, dude? That's spooky that you knew all that, because that's really what happened. Pretty spooky, man. It was like them dude you're getting a Dell commercials, but it was like dude you're living in a Dell forever. <laughs> Nicely done. Let's uh swim.
Yo, look at Guru go. Look at him. He's fucking Michael Phelps. I'm doing it too. Now we're going. Now we're fucking going. Yo, what up, PA Master? How's it going, man? Look at the form. The excellence. Look at our shadows. <laughs> yeah, what up, Bio? How's it going, man? I hope everybody chilling on the infinite couch is having a good night. I've had a great one. Did like uh, three hours of Reign of Kings earlier. Now we've been chilling with some Daisy Guru just uh, found me in game, so we'll see what kind of shit we get up to. Um. Yeah. The O show is on a schedule now. If you always struggle to catch it, I broadcast pretty much every day from uh, 9 p.m. Pacific until 3 a.m. or uh, that's midnight Eastern. Until 6 in the morning. Sometimes it might be a little earlier. Sometimes it might be a little later. We're playing on a hardcore server right now. So it's first person only. And this server is like role playing and courage. Like you don't have to. But if you do it's cool. Earlier we encountered... Three of the worst shots in all of Daisy history. Um, but they got me in the end. My axe foo was not up to par. Oh my god. Yes. I'm a player, bro. What? Yo, what up, Kraken? How's it going, bruh? Yo, man, you missed the Reign of Kings.
Drink that palm water. Get Giardia, bro. Do it. Gatsby says Ale 8 Pond, dude. I would drink a pond of Ale 8. Oh man, that sounds delicious. Tomatum says that pond must have some stanky ass stagnant water. You can't actually get sick from drinking it. There's like uh, tabs to clean the water, but you can't get sick. Guru has just got a really good immune system, so he's not really worried about it, you know? Rip FPS. Uh oh, that spray paint though. Little green SKS action. I think that's all I can paint right now. Yeah. Hacksaw is kind of cool because you can make sawed off weapons. I've got a little bit of room, so I'll grab it right now. All important shades here. Beautiful. Go, go. Hell yeah. Rice. Some of the best food in the game. Oh yeah. Should I actually have a melee weapon ready. Yeah, man. I guess my character is not feeling like uh, vaulting to the. Tomato, meh. Another sledgehammer. Clearly damaged. I'm telling you, the non damaged sledgehammer is a myth. Actually, the tomato is probably worth. I've got plenty of room right now. Can we jump in now? Yay! Nice outfit. Nice. Nice, I got a double gun this shit.
I can load one round into it at a time. Because I don't have the magazine. <laughs> Alright, I do have a loaded weapon now. Hooray! This 22 is going to save our lives. You don't even understand. You don't even understand. The sporter is love. I got my 122 round at a time. I'm ready for action, dude. Moving toward the police station. This is where things can get a little more interesting. The odds of the police station being looted up are very high. Alright, so... Uh, I like uh, the... Camo of the black boonie hat, but the helmet actually is going to give me more protection, so... I guess it's green, it could be worse. I'm not cracking the uh, the server didn't reset when they Whoa the one bullet dream yeah my Would have roasted Guru if he was a bad guy. Would have roasted him. Yeah, here we go. What we got here? Uh, it's just a damaged bandana cap. Look at a full stack of rags, though. Six rags. Yeah, what's just all the fucking red clothes out here, though? Alright, this provides more knockout protection than the, uh, hard hat. I will grab the gray hoodie, though. Looks like this was another player's shit. I ditched some of it. Ooh, there we go. That'll help me a little bit. Actually, my sporter's at the bottom because it's in my hand, so I should put this ammo, like, way down here. Alright, that blue, not the best, but... 
All right, I'm about to put this border down for a moment and eat this food. Guru's in the area though, so hopefully it'll be safe. Did it disappear? No, it's right there. Perfect. All right. Me some rice. The Yub says, nice backpack. Yeah, it's bright blue. I like the backpacks that are a little more camo. I mean, my overall camo is a little bit better, but still not very good. All right, now I'm very thirsty from all that rice. I'll just dish the tomato. Take this water back in my hands. That sounded really bad. It sounded like automatic fire. I think Guru just got gunned down back here. I heard brap brap brap. I have one round of my sporter, dude. I'm fucked. I'm not gonna try and engage, I don't think. I think I'm bailing. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm gone. Later. All right, here we go, though. All right, we'll watch for a little bit. Yo, man. Rip Guru. I want to watch and see, man. If I get the right opportunity, dude, one bullet, one dream. There he is right there. Y'all see him? Run into the police station just now. He just ran into the police station. He's currently in there. I just heard him shoot again. Sounds like he's got like an M4 or something. Now this is a private hive, so like... That dude either had to really earn that M4 or he had to hack it in one of the two. Because <laughs> uh, you can't bring your gear in from another server onto a private hive. So either that dude has a legit M4 that he really had to earn on this server or he hacked it in. He just ran across. He's in a yellow house now. He has an AUG? Okay. 
Sounds like that's some kind of automatic. Logs are pretty rare. But I'm not going to say that he hacked it in. Who knows, you know? Outside. But he came outside, then he didn't. Oh, the server restarted. Ah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and Devin says, do you have more bullets and this only holds one at a time? That's correct, yeah. But you can't find a magazine for the sporter. Then it gets really good. Shoo, y'all. Alright, um... I think I'm going to take a quick break and then we'll hop back in. It'll be a fast one though. Take a quick break here. I'll go ahead and restart my client. Uh, Salty says your guy was shaking bad. Yeah, he's actually about to throw up. So. But I'm going to restart my client too. But let's take a quick break here. Now, the OSHA will be live for at least about another hour here. Um, I'm going to take a quick break here before we continue on. We'll be finishing up with about another hour more day Z. Think about switching server types. I'm thinking about it. I haven't decided yet. But I'll decide during the break. Had an awesome time on the O Show as usual though. Big ups to everybody who chooses to hang out on the Infinite Couch once again. I have set up a stream schedule so now the O Show is live just about every day. 9 p.m. Pacific to 3 a.m. Pacific. But it is time to take a little break here. I to try to encourage you to take a break as well. Stand up, stretch, drink some water, do something like that. That's what I'm gonna do. Should be a pretty quick one. Then we'll be back with about an hour or so more of Daisy. That'll be it for the O Show. I'll be back with you guys soon.
Yo, what is good? Thank you so much for your patience during that break. We are entering into the final segment of this O show. We're going to be finishing things off with some more Daisy. I'm probably going to hop back into that same server. Or I might hop into another one. It depends on what the situation looks like. I'd like to see the resolution of that. But a lot of you guys seem to think that dude's a hacker. So I don't know. I don't know if I'm trying to fuck with a hacker right now. As always, though, I definitely appreciate you guys chilling on the Infinite Couch. The O Show is live every day, 9 to 3 Pacific. Sometimes earlier, sometimes later. I think it's funny that y'all are just now starting to add each other on Steam and stuff. When I've we've had that like Steam group since like day one. That's the whole point, yo. Cause usually if someone's chilling at the O show, then they're like a cool person to play games with, so it makes sense to like have a group where you guys can play games together, you feel me? I know it's crazy. I guess people worry about being bad at games, but who gives a fuck? The point of games are an enjoyable, leisurely activity. People that take video games too seriously are indicative of someone who doesn't have enough going on in their life to give them other things to take seriously. You feel me? I play video games to relax, personally. I don't know about y'all. I do have a very smexy looking character though. Though I actually have the uh, SKS on my... back and I have a sporter in my hands. I'm really curious as to what's up on that server though. Like what if I get a lucky shot off and get the AUG? But I actually don't know if a single 22 round can penetrate a motorcycle helmet and that's what he had on uh yo what do y'all think y'all think i should hop into the same server or should i pick a different one get a let's get some infinite couch input here i honestly can't decide and he gives me an excuse to drink some tea Salty says, Devo brings people together like love or poverty. I like it. Roll the dice for the AUG. All right, a yup convinced me. A yup convinced me. Gotta go balls of steel. I just hope that I don't get synced like out in the field. I hope I'm still in the bush. Be 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 inside of the bush. You're kind of close to it. You're closest. That was good enough. Ah, oh, the sporter's not in my fucking hands. The sporter fell out of my hands when the sir. No, there it is. Oh my god, please. Please. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Woo. I thought the sporter got deleted. Alright, we gotta hang out for a second and see what the situation is. I was gonna be very like not that the sporter is that much more helpful but I was gonna be kind of sad you know if the server restarted that police station's worth looting but aug bro is totally around dude aug bro is here I can feel aug bro's presence I want to try to move up into those trees and circle around so I can see the police station. But I don't want to make a ton of noise by sprinting, but I'm going to move like a crawl this way. Yeah, man. Don't worry about me.
Worry about that log. A yup says, when can I watch Bean play Cook Serve Delicious? Because that game gets intense. She's really good at it too. Um, I'm actually planning on having her stream sometimes. Just having her take over the Osho from time to time. I think that would be fun. What up, Sarge? How's it going, bro? Yo, man, if y'all are just tuning in, we're at the tail end of a great stream. Did some Reign of Kings for a couple hours earlier. The Order of O's coming along. Now, uh, Guru just got rolled by... We're on a hardcore server. It's like a uh, roleplay encourage, but not, you know, enforced. So there's a lot of PvP. Um, Guru just got rolled by a guy with an AUG. A lot of y'all think he's a hacker. I don't, I'm not sure. But uh, the server restarted, so I jumped back on to see if maybe I could get lucky and get his AUG. All I have is a sporter with no mag. Um... I might even be better off with my axe than this thing, but I haven't seen or heard any movement down there. I'd like to circle up here and get an eye on the police station, though. Because if the server just restarted and that dude doesn't log back in, um, it could be worth. I don't like to accuse people of hacking, but if this is a private hive and you have a AUG and you don't log back in, you're probably cheating, dude. He probably doesn't give a shit. He just like loaded in, hacked in an AUG, killed somebody, and peace. <laughs> nah, who knows? Who knows? I'm just sad that he rolled Guru. Not that we even were armed, but... He had motorcycle helmet on. He had Guru's red jacket. Um, so it should be easy to spot if he's still running around. But the last I saw him, he was right there in Yellow House. I should have looted that barn before I came this way, but it's all, it's all Gucci. I'm going to chill here for a moment and see if I see him running around in Yellow House. Like, maybe... He's taking a shit. Like he upset. Maybe he's taking a dump. I was thinking though, this sporter, even though it's like single shot, it's the perfect little zombie plinker. Because it's not very loud. Tomato says, We're, that's a weird mentality. Log on to a private server just to hack, kill a few people, and move to a different server. Where's the fun in that? Well, I mean, people do that type of shit a lot, though. It's like a inadequacy thing. You know, they feel inadequate in their day-to-day -day life. So they look for a realm where they can be all-powerful. And one way to do that is to hack in a video game. So I don't really f judge them, you know. They're just dealing. It's just another form of like getting drinks at the bar or something. It's just another way to feel better about yourself. <clears throat> so I don't really, I don't really hate on it, but I do understand it. Salty says, I'll judge for you, Dave. Uh, nah, you shouldn't judge either, though, you know? It's not good for you. I'm just playing a video game and having fun. The 
Despite all the bugs and the low FPS, I still really love DayZ. So if Bohemia comes through with the renderer and gets a decent rendering engine on here, man, I'll be a happy boy. Yo, am I going to be the first person to the police station? I really doubt it. Incoming rolled by AUG. Go. Just go. Sprint. He's in here. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. He's waiting. He's behind the door. He's in here. He's in the corner. He's waiting. You can hear me. He's right here. He's behind everything. He's up there. Yo, yeah, no one's looted this for real. Go, 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 go. Go, bro. Go. Oh, shit. Pretty sure we got first looterinis on here. Because of the server restart. Oh, please. I just want the sardinis. Thank you. <laughs> please. Alright. Oh, shit, man. I'm gonna shut the door. Go, go, go. Thank you. I'm gonna shut that one, too. Alright, good. Banana. Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm, I'm about to roll the worst police station you can. Look at this. I'm about to roll... The worst possible police station in the game. In the in one of the gun rooms, I got a banana. <laughs> like I could hold the banana like a gun and be like, "Watch out, bandit!" <clears throat> Two ice axes, a baseball bat. That's actually gonna be better than the shovel. Oh my god, this police station right now. <laughs> oh man. <clears throat> Lil Pimp says, look out Dave, he's in the trees. Nah. He's not. About to have rolled the worst police station ever, man. <laughs> Yo, at least maybe a magazine or some ammo. Or, uh. What we got? Another sporter! Oh my god. <laughs> oh man. For real police station. All right, let's uh, what we got here a banana. God damn this police station to fucking hell, dude. This is the worst. Literally, I've never seen a worse police station in the game. Completely. I'm fucking out of here, dude. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna run out the front door. I'm gonna actually have my sporter away so I can run. Alright, we gone. Yo, that was the worst, dude, for real. <clears throat> I'm gonna go hide up in the trees and eat and drink, and then I'm gonna come back down and loot some more. Yo, Ninth Gate raises a good point. Can we get an informal poll on who is wearing pants right now uh, on the infinite couch? I'm dying of dehydration, I know, bro. I'm working on it, man. I promise we're going to get you set up here. I personally don't have pants on. I have some delightful basketball shorts going on right here.
Do boxer shorts count as pants? Ask the yup. No, they do not. They do not. Alright, Sporter. Don't disappear on me, bro. Woo, it didn't. Ah, Nixon, what's good? I haven't seen your name in chat in a minute. I'm wearing pants because it's kind of cold. Shameful, bro. <laughs> Shameful. Salty says no clothes whatsoever. Yo, I wonder how many people watch my stream naked, dude. I hope a lot. That's all things that I'd use my clothes to make bandages. Alright, that's respectable. I give that one to you. Fuck, I'm stuffed, dude, but I'm still thirsty. I'm gonna go for it and eat this sardines and hope I don't puke. Because it's got uh, moisture in it. Use the hacksaw to open the sardines, that's right. Alchemist says when I watch her from bed, I'm naked. Damn, a lot of nudity goes on on the infinite couch. I like to hear it. <laughs> okay. I'm going to have to just risk it and go down here and loot. I gotta try to get something going. That police station had fucking nothing in it. SKS rounds would be fine. Like a shotgun would be fine. Like... Tabatum says, hopefully you Febreze the couch, Dave. Yo, I hose it down now that y'all get naked on it. Yo, a Pozniski. Thank you for following, man. I definitely appreciate it. And that does get us a little bit closer to unlocking Chivo number two at 2,000. So big ups, man. Thank you. I'm glad you're enjoying. Salty says, is it leather? Nah, it's vinyl. That way, like, when you all have, you know, juices on it, we can just, uh, hose it down, you feel me? Alright, I'm gonna loot these real quick. If I can. Alright. Fucking nothing, dude. Yo, a pristine sledgehammer. It's not a myth, it is real. Behold. Alright, what we got here? Cargo pants. Pristine, I like it, I like it. <laughs> the pitchfork is like the worst weapon in the game. I don't even think it can connect with anything. Yo, know, pristine pipe wrench is pretty good, but that sledgehammer. What condition are you, Helmet? Damage. Alright, same. Need a better helmet, like, for sure. Fuck it, man. I'm gonna loot up these houses over here where Ogbro was at. Maybe he, like, died to hacks or something. I'll find his Og on the ground. 
blood bag kit. These can be handy if you combine them with an IV kit, but most cases you're so much better off with a saline kit. It's like not even worth it. But I got so much room right now, so whatever. Gotta have some sunglasses. You can't really see them under my motorcycle visor, but um, I have them on. Don't worry. Oh, the Ushanka. The most adorable headpiece in Daisy. Alright, gun house. Have a gun. Have a sporter mag. Have, I don't know, something. Other than ruined clothes and ruined clothes. I'll be damned. got here the worn gray hoodie same blood test kit that'll be fun to play with we'll test our blood guys start placing your bets now what blood type is my character what do you think it's gonna be is it gonna be O positive O negative a B positive could it be place your bets what do you think what do you think what will this dude's blood type be Oh, hold up, hold up. There we go. I have even cooler glasses on underneath now. A little tuner. Excellent. Tuna has water in it, so I'll eat it real quick because my character is still thirsting. Try to park up against this. Alright, first of all, drop the sporter. Don't delete, don't delete. Okay. Second thing. Let's test my blood real quick. O positive. Got it. O positive. That's what I guess, so I win. Now eat the tuna. Alright, I'm still thirsty, damn it, but Warren Gray Combat, now I got pristine wellies, baby. Got over here. Ooh, a bandage. Don't mind if I do.
Woo! What do we got in here? A wrench? Alright! A fucked up hat? Yeah! Damn! Alright. Still nobody around here, dude. Also, like, finding no good loot, though. Um, I'm thinking I'm probably going to head inland here. I'm going to head inland and then north. <laughs> Savannah says, once again, the loot placement is done by jack shit. <laughs> so true, dude. So fucking true. So on this server, people tend to roam the coast a lot. Um, so maybe I'll head north east a little bit. I'm sorry, northwest a little bit here. And uh, see if I can't find a truck or something. Because the server restarted recently, so we should get reset trucks. I really love playing uh, Daisy in hardcore mode. Though. The first person really makes it a lot more like intense, tactical. You gotta like check things more. But overall, it makes it more enjoyable. Playing in hardcore also shows you how much your breath affects your aim and how important it is to occasionally like stop and get your breath back. Like check out my aim right now. Cause my character's wet and he's kinda chilly. If I run and then try to aim, it's like terrible. Which is pretty realistic, to be real. Running makes your hands shake a lot, that type of thing. But if you hear your character, like, hardcore dogging it, like, panting like crazy, you're never gonna hit your shots, ever. Like, watch, I'll run, like, insane. Get my breath up, and then we'll aim it, and you'll see. See that sway? That sway comes from sprinting. And then that shake uh, is from being wet and cold. So I, I do have the materials to do it, but ideally I'd warm up by a fire. And probably drink some water, actually. So my character is dehydrated a bit. But, like, I mean, all I have is a one round at a time sporter, so. A yup says this crouching reduce sway regardless of situation. Yeah, it, it helps a bit no matter what, and going prone helps a bit more no matter what. And a lot of times, prone can um, almost completely eliminate.
12 says third person with fog of war would be great. I don't think you could really do third person and get the same results as uh, first person in any FPS. Because you, there's no way to eliminate this. Like, right? Like, alright, I'll explain why it can never be different. Alright, if I'm prone behind this tree, if I want to look out and see, I have to lean like that. Alright, otherwise I can't see. I have to expose myself, look, and then not expose myself. You feel me? Exposing yourself is key here. Don't expose yourself in public. But anyway. Um, in third person, I could just lay behind this tree all day and see everything for miles. So th I, there's no reason to ever have to expose yourself. So, uh... It turns firefights into stalemates, basically. If that makes any sense. But I'm glad that the option's there. Because it's cool to be able to see your character. Um, so I, I feel you there. I don't hate on third person. But I think first is a lot more tactical, adrenaline-y, all that type of stuff. Yo, what up, gentlemen? I think it's the first time I saw your name tonight. What's up, y'all? Appreciate you guys chilling on the infinite couch. Man, the O show is just in getting so consistent and just like fun every time. I'm digging it. Speaking of consistent, the O show is on an official schedule now. An official schedule. Uh, 9 p.m. Pacific to 3 a.m. Pacific just about every day and that translates to 12 p.m. or midnight the witching hour on the East Coast until 6 a.m. Sometimes I'll start a little earlier or later sometimes I'll go a little later so you feel me Gentlemen says how's it going David? Going great man been enjoying some fucking March Madness. I love college basketball, so I'm always happy in March. Uh, played some Reign of Kings earlier. That was really fun. Always have a great time with that game. Even in its very rough state. Uh, now we're finishing things off with some uh, Daisy Standalone. Man, I've been feeling some Daisy Standalone recently. I don't know why. I think it's that immersion. Ah, uh, yeah, and Devin says the new bow in H1Z1 that can only be found. The recurve bow. I haven't got to try it, but yeah, that's... H1Z1 is blown up, man. It's a good time to be into hardcore survival games. Because there's so fucking many different ones. Man, I hope I get to plink a zombie with this border. That's all I really want to do. Look, guys, a rainbow. Yay. I'm going to stand here and enjoy the rainbow for a second. Bio says, if H1Z1 didn't have Battle Royale, it would have been dead by now. Nah. Survival mode in that game is hopping. You're wrong, sir, I have to say, in my opinion. So many people on survival mode. It's crazy. Gentleman says, did you ever find that guy? Yeah, we, but we could only kill him. We couldn't capture him. Man, the Reign of King streams, honestly, gentlemen, if you like that role-playing shit, I would, like, watch it all, dude, because you would really enjoy the VOD. So much shit happened that, like, I couldn't even highlight it. Like, the whole thing was a highlight. So much RP shit happened, it was amazing. It was so funny.
Yo, how am I doing on thirst? I know I'm not in good shape. Oh, man. I'm about to start dying of dehydration, folks. Yo, and Devin says, I like how many people are saying how great the server was. Makes me feel like we're bringing something to the game. Yeah, they do really appreciate uh, the RP, for sure. They like the order a lot, the order of O. Uh... Reign, Reign of Kings is really fun. If you just like a really chill, casual, silly game. Uh, but don't get me wrong, there's a definite hardcore aspect. Kraken and I broke into a dude's base overnight and robbed him, dude. Fucking robbed him. Like, took everything. So, like... And if you die, you drop all your loot. And, like, it's very easy to get your shit completely fucked. So, beware. <laughs> Raid of Kings is a total cakewalk. And they are steadily doing shit like, uh, increasing the, like they've already made it so you have to eat and drink a lot more, or you'll die, stuff like that. Alright. Yo. I think he passed out. I think he'll be passed out. I think he passed out. It's <laughs> reload my supporter. <laughs> Yo, that was Guru, guaranteed. Guaranteed that was Guru. Guaranteed. Whip, looks like I got an improvised backpack. Very good. Very good. Can ditch this uh, machete now too. I even need this. Uh, need that shit. Shit out of here. <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah, poor guru indeed. Yo, man. Guru's used to it. Lil Pimp says, you're gonna pass out if you don't find water. Yeah, dude, I'm in trouble on this water shit. I think there's a pump in town, though. Well, I put one sporter to the dome, Guru. I put you out of your misery, buddy. I just can't get over this loot pile. I think I've trapped myself with the loot. I'm fucking serious. I'm literally trapped behind the loot. I'm literally not even joking. <laughs> literally. <laughs> no! Damn you, Guru. I'm trapped behind the loot, for real. What the fuck? Can we? Can I do them too? And it's enough. What the fuck? The sticks? Oh my god! Get out of the way. Can I go now? What else is it? <laughs> Please just let me out of here, game. Oh my god, bro. Alright. You guys know what's about to happen. I'm just gonna have to do it, guys. Instant karma says to bait him. That's what it is. Oh... Right in the kisser. Whoo! Good night. <laughs> Gentlemen goes, I'm about to pass out. Better kill myself. Exactly. All right, I think I want to do one more life. All right, one more life. One more life. I was like debating calling the stream, but one more, one more. I'm having fun. I don't want to stream too long because I want to like really start nailing the streaming every day thing. So I'm trying to keep it to about six hours, but one more life. Damn, shooting yourself in the face in a video game. 'm naked and I'm ready to fight let's go in before immediately sniped in the head We got that cattle prod. See, kids, this is why you hang on to your battery. Because then you get a cattle prod. We're going to be cattle prodding something. Oh, yeah.
That electro party. Getting electro spawns pretty good, I reckon. We got in here a hatchet. Oh uh, man. Hatchet is very handy. I'll take it in my hands. Chop people up. Alright, that sewing kit's actually badass because it's like infinite bandages. Because you can suture yourself up like a fucking champion. Ooh, shotgun rounds, that's what I like to see. Yo, pristine baseball bat. Nice, nice. In fact, ditch the hatchet. And, uh... Baseball bat. Yep. Yep. Some tactical bacon. Alright. So I don't remember if this will delete this if my inventory is full, so I'm gonna put these rags down for a second. Then we'll smash open the can with the baseball bat. And then eat what's left. <laughs> I'm like licking bacon off the uh baseball bat like that. Ah, um. Licking that bacon off the baseball bat. You know you'd watch. So my FPS in Electro is going to be like 11. <laughs> Boy, usually Electro is where the party is. Caveman level of can opening says Sabatum. Pretty much. Yo, brass knuckles. Those are pretty cool, but they're not as cool as a baseball bat. But one big advantage to brass knuckles, if you're using them alongside with a gun, is you can instantly switch to brass knuckles. So for real, if you have a, if you're using a gun, try to find brass knuckles as your melee. Because there's no animation to pull them out. They're just boom in your hand. So someone can run up on you and at the last second you can switch and punch them. But they think you, they, you're you going to have your gun out. It's pretty hype. A little dry bag. Bright red target on my back now. That's what I like to see. Now people will bring it, you know. They'll see the red target. They'll be like a bull. Aw, oh, damn. Am I going to be Father Christmas out here? I think I am. Yo, I'm Santa. That's what I got to tell people. I'm Santa Claus. Don't hurt me. Got the SKS bayonet because it can actually open uh, cans of food really nicely. You can't stab anybody with it, but. Thought I heard a zombie aggro. Oh, here we go.
Hello? 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 Yo, is this Guru again though? Hello? Hello? Hello?